Hey everyone, in this tutorial, I will be teaching you how to use threads. We use threads so our program can multitask, but in this tutorial, we'll be focusing on one thread instead of multiple threads. So let's begin. In order to make a thread, type in the object thread, the variable equals new thread. Once you get done with this, let's work on this constructor. Type out try and catch because our computers can't always catch up with their threads. So it's good to use the try and catch. Let's type in error system dot out print line error. All right, well now we're done with the catch. All right, for the purpose of this uh, program, we want our uh, message to be displayed 10 times. So therefore, we'll be using the for loop. You don't have to use this uh, example, but it's better to see the results like this with threads. So type in for int i equals zero. The condition will be i is less than or equal to 10. And let's increment the i. Now let's type up our message. System dot out dot print line. Let's display high. And now let's use this thread. So th dot yeah we want our message to be delayed after it's outputted for a second so you'll see what I mean after you see the result so use th dot sleep and for one second it's 1000 millisecond so yeah now we're done so yeah we use the for loop to output this message, uh, this message ten times, and we use the sleep method to delay that output for one second after the first input or output was made. So now let's run it to demonstrate it. Now you see high, but if we were to add in another thread, then we'll be seeing high Bob. But it's really depend on the time that we specify on the delay on the other thread. Well yeah, this concludes my tutorial over how to use threads. So stay tuned for the next tutorial and thanks for watching.